going on guys? We're back today with another reaction video. We are watching The Clone Wars Season 5, Episode 10. I believe this episode is called The Phantom Apprentice. Oh. Uh, very excited to check this one out. This is part 2 of the final arc of The Clone Wars. And last week's episode was just amazing. I absolutely loved it. This arc is off to a, an amazing start. This is what I've been waiting for this season. And so, very, very excited to... Uh, get back into this arc. Last time we left off, Ahsoka was getting ready to face off against Maul, so yeah, let's just get into this and see what happens. Okay, here we go. Oh, wow. Hmm. We're very much setting up this episode to be all ominous, so. Oh, here we are. Certainly, General Albeer would have come himself. Perhaps bring his loyal foe, Skywalker, is it? Master Kenobi had a more important engagement. Oh, indeed. The moment may be upon us. Oh, that's right. Maul knows what the overall plan was, he just never got to be a part of it. Why you? Or if I am correct, soon. The Jedi and the Republic will no longer be the controlling interest in the galaxy. And who will be? You? No. Darth Sidious. Oh. <laughs> of Duel of the Fates. Sounds like it to me. Is that there Obi-Wan? I wonder where we're at in Revenge of the Sith. But for the most part, you're... He mentioned a name. Darth Sidious. Oh, Obi-Wan knows Sidious? that. I do not know much, but I will share with you what the Council suspects. Darth Sidious is the Sith Lord who orchestrated the Clone Wars and played both sides of it from the beginning. I first learned the name from Count Dooku, though any chance of learning more about Sidious from Dooku has been lost. <gasps> Why? Because Count Dooku is dead. Oh. Anakin killed him while rescuing the Chancellor. With Dooku oh. gone, we've lost a vital link to understanding the mystery of Darth Sidious. If you can it's interesting that the Maul, Jedi know they are being be played, but I guess they have kind of established that in the fifth and sixth season. Then send me more men. May I speak to Ahsoka alone for a moment? I like that they're addressing what's going on with the characters right now and why they're not coming back instead doing other stuff. I, I, I like this. The Chancellor has been a great friend and mentor. This is interesting because last time she was criticizing them for putting the Chancellor this. above the people, and now she no, seems to be not. kind of in the reverse. So perhaps but... it's best that you do speak with him. And what? Defend the Council's actions? I hardly think I'm the best person for that. Ah, uh, yeah. The See, it's like, what Tell would have happened if... I will like what would have happened if Ahsoka had you know uh, been able to reach out to Anakin if this hadn't been going on but you know we'll just never know. I love the vibe of this episode it's very different from the first episode in this arc but I like that. We got ambushed on our way to reinforce the entry port on sea deck. Maul he <laughs> he went right through us one by one he was asking about you the Ark Trooper, Jesse, Maul realized he was older, somehow, looked in his mind, <laughs> and he took him, he took Jesse alive. Whoa. You're wasting me. No, there are some things I need to know, and you're going to help me. We can go round and round in this. Well, seems much more what? reserved in this art in anything. comparison to others, but I kind of like it. It is not up to you. Your mind will speak, or it will break. Ah, <laughs> uh, going Kylo Ren on. A BB unit. 
orange and white. Like Ahsoka. Just Kenobi he wanted. No, uh, there was someone else he was interested in. Who? If only I could remember the name. Uh. Well, help him remember. Oh, uh, so maybe Maul oh, sensed what was coming in one of them. There we go. Oh, oh! Gotta keep up. What name? Sky Ooga. Oh, Maul knows what's coming. Just like we do. Maul kind of represented the audience in this case. Oh, so the Shadow Collective is still a thing. <gasps> what's going on? Maul just told the Syndicate leaders to go into hiding. That was... That was Dryden you Boss from Solo. You liberated me from my imprisonment by Sidious and his apprentice. At the time, I thought Dooku was an old fool, but now... Now I see. Oh. He and I are the same. One step behind. <laughs> the dark side has never been stronger. My lord. What does it mean? I like how they're summing up the events of the Darth Maul, Son of Dathomir comic series. The galaxy. It is not the way of your people to hide here in the gutters. If you die, I promise you, it will be on the field of battle. <laughs> This is kind of unintentionally foreshadowing what's going to happen once the Empire has control of the planet. The Republic forces will depart once we capture Maul. Then you will have your opportunity to lead. <gasps> I agree. <laughs> oh, wow. That was My lady, is that any way to treat your rifle? This is an interesting turn of events. Run along. There you go. Back to your brothers. <sighs> Stay on my account, we'll be fine. Go. What is his game? I mean, I know what his game is, but... Were you not cast out of your order? I left voluntarily. Yes, but you were motivated to leave by the hypocrisy of the Jedi Council. Oh. This is an interesting twist, I like it. I Too late! For what? The Republic to fall? It already has, and you just can't see it. There is no justice, no law, no order, except for the one that will replace it. The time of the Jedi has passed. They cannot defeat Sidious. But together, you and I... one question you have but to ask what do you want with anakin skywalker he is the key to everything to bring balance to the force to destroy he has long been groomed for his role as my master's new apprentice you lie I'm afraid not. In fact, I 
was so certain of his fate that I orchestrated this war to lure him here with Kenobi. Oh. To kill him. Thus depriving Sidious of his prized pupil. Oh my god. Die! 